I promise to break for a positive fate. Why don't you get drafted? So that's funny to you? You notice how all your questions about the result never the work? It was a simple question. Why do you think I didn't get drafted? I mean, for real. You tell me. I know you had two knee surgeries in college. Nah, it's excuses. I don't know, you stayed all four years? I wanted to get my degree, try again. You were captain of your team, conference player of the year, all, all team nice defense. All nice awards, things I've earned, things I'm actually proud of. But the NBA scouts agenda, you don't care about all that. I mean, sure, you got leadership, character, defensive motor, all that helps, that's real. Think about those other things. Well, what position do I play? You're a point guard. Yeah, and with my size, my body frame, can I play anything else? And what about my leaping ability? You can dunk. Can I dunk like those good dunkers, the good dunkers you even see at the street games? And is it explosive? A word they love to use. Okay, so you had some of it, but not all of it. I mean, from my perspective, no, but from their perspective, yeah. And when a GM goes on record and says, you're his guy, and he says that to his team, his whole career and yours are inextricably linked. Okay, if I become a star, so do they. If I wash out, same. So they've all agreed on this checklist, this protocol, right? If Duke doesn't check all the boxes, and some other guy does. So they draft the other guy. They draft the other guy. Because at least they can say he checked all the boxes. Yeah. The fault goes back on the players, not them. Okay, that's why you gotta understand this mentality, son. You gotta make sure you check all the boxes for them. Okay, this draft cycle business, this is a chess match. Okay, if you're not ready for that, you are bound to fail. That's the setup. Whew, now most people on the outside won't see it. But this, my friend, is where the draft begins. The suit shop? Mm-hmm. Messaging is everything. Okay, so is there a wrong choice here? Mm. Think of it like a spectrum. One end, you got Russell Westbrook, loud on and off court. On the other, you got Kawhi, quiet on and off court. Beautiful choice. We'll put this together and have it for you right away. Thank you. Listen, Art. I haven't had a chance to bring oh, it up. And it's all good, I already know. Oh, you do? Yeah. Harper and her team run a top sports agency for a reason. They contacted me as soon as they contacted you. You're not upset? Why would I be? Someone take the meeting. I want you to. Root out the specifics. Look, just because you sign with them doesn't mean we're a done deal. We can all work together. Okay. 
I'm going to do the plan first. Here's the line. I'm the associate agent, so when you sign with the agency, I'll be here to support Harper on the day-to-day. -day. I'm sorry, I completely spaced on your name <laughs> walking in. It's fair, you have a lot going on. It's Layla. Layla. Layla, <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Have a seat. Yeah, yeah. Junior, hello. So excited to have you here. <laughs> I'm Harper Dell. Thank you so much for coming down to hear our pitch. Yeah, I'm excited to be here. Yeah, and thank you for taking the time out to meet me. Absolutely. This is the moment. You have worked your entire life to get here, and we are here to support you in that journey to the next step where you start getting paid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to tell you, we have the deepest roster of NBA talent in the world and brand partnerships with every company you can name. Our goal is long-term. <laughs> we wanna create lifelong relationships that keep you living large now and comfortable in your retirement. In these notes, already rest the shoe contract of your dreams. <laughs> you ever thought about acting? No. Uh, <laughs> I never really considered it, but I'm, you know, I'm into it if it makes sense. Yeah. Multiple commercial offers and scripts for interesting indies that will help groom you for bigger projects once you get your feet wet. Um, all of that sounds really good to me. Yeah, but right now, I just want to focus on the draft, solidify my position, and you know, find the team where my skills fit best. Well, we have relationships with all the teams. We can gather intel to get you the private team workouts that you but want. maybe not the exact team I want to play for? Anything is possible. But it is still a draft where teams can and will do what they see fit for their organization. Okay, so that's a no. <laughs> Chaos exists. We try and mitigate that for you, but it does exist. And I'm not going to lie to you just to get you to sign. I want us to start off in a place where we can be honest with each other. You know what? This is feeling way too formal. Way too formal. Hang on. <sighs> That's better. Much better. <laughs> <laughs> so I grew up in the Salinas Valley. It's about two hours south of San Francisco. John Steinbeck was from there. Do you know it? Uh, no, not that area <laughs> That's specifically, okay. no. <laughs> My parents died when I was young, so my grandmother raised us on her ranch. We grew broccoli, lettuce, cauliflower. It was not glamorous, but we worked and survived. And Layla? Oh, I was uh, raised right down the road from you and Union. Oh, Jersey represent. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> yeah. Um, my dad bailed on us when I was three, and my mom did everything in her power to make it work. We know what it's like to want more. We willed ourselves to be where we are, just like you did. There's a vision for you here. Jordan, LeBron, a bigger corporate vision. Companies love them because their messaging connects to the public across all demographics. And that's how we want to position your endorsements going forward. Universal appeal. Okay. But it, it feels like there's a catch coming. No, there's no catch. There is a little reality. Archie, he's a good guy, and we know that he brought you here, which is why we want to provide him with a generous finder's fee as a parachute. But for us, we need you free and clear of all old attachments. Your future depends on an uncluttered vision. All new NBA players have to go through these difficult transitions. So it's you guys or him? From our perspective, it's just the way it has to be. You should hear what he has to say. Maybe he really is the right fit for you and for your vision. But for us, it's one or the other. I don't like it. Not one bit. Fine. I'm not afraid of a little competition. But her pitch on the corporate take is a flat idea. You have personality and you have an opinion. Your boy Hendrix Cobb, 
Pardon? Embiid? They're doing just fine being who they are. That's how we seal your endorsements. Big and bold. But doesn't that idea risk losing endorsements if I'm seen as controversial? Yes. Yes, it will. But you'll gain others. Others that share your vision and your story. Former football player. Newark. Your dad. You're the underdog. That stuff is powerful, so right, use so you it. you contract available for me now? No, I don't. But I will. It's called trust, Junior. Uh, she says she got a movie deal available for deals? me now. Deals? Or ideas where deals may be? I don't know. It seems to me like you should. These big agencies, man, they, they pack a punch nowadays. She may have a little bit more firepower than me right now. But I know who you are. I know where you come from. And I know what you want. As if it were my own story. But fine, if you want to walk away from all of that, so be it. It's either her or me. You choose. Listen, uh, things haven't always been smooth between us, but I know you, good and bad. Yeah, I, I, I could dig it. And the fact that you're from here means something. I know I'm making the right choice. Thank you, Junior. I won't let you down. I know you won't, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, sir. You're projected in the lottery. Now, I know you might think you're rock solid, but you can still step out of line. Okay, how so? <laughs> Bad press. Or anything off court that won't sit right with the GM. You know? You can tumble. Blow your personal work up. Tumble? Yeah, I mean, you know, it's real simple, man. Just be smart. The next step in this process is the same, whether you're lottery or not. It's the league personality evaluation test. They put you in a room with an interviewer who asks you a bunch of probing questions about yourself. <laughs> okay, so I'll just be honest. You know, let them know yeah, why. Yeah, but, you know, be aware of what they want to hear. Integrity, character, leadership. And keep that in the back of your mind when you're answering questions and you'll do just fine. Hey, you D. What's good, my boy? Mr. 305. Yes, sir. Wade County. 16 years later. We done made history. Blue rings on our... Junior, welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice Go to meet ahead you and take too. A seat. Thank you. This isn't a test. This isn't an interrogation. We're here to have a discussion, the point of which is to get to know you better as a person. There are no right or wrong answers. All we want is for you to be as open and honest as possible. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, let's get started. What would one of your family members tell us about you? That's a good question. I think they tell you that even as a kid, I always wanted to be the best. I loved to compete. Didn't matter if it was tic-tac-toe or dodgeball or whatever. I wanted to win. I needed to. And that's the first thing they'd say? Oh, yeah. And I used to take losing. <laughs> I used to take losing really hard. I'd throw a fit if I didn't win. My family still teasing me about it. Great. Let's move on. I'm curious. How do you deal with teammates you don't like? I don't worry about that too much. No matter what, I'm going to do me. So whether or not I like a guy's personality, that doesn't really factor. Could you talk a little more about that? 
I just play to win. So whatever I need to do to win, I'm going to do that. And if you're about winning too, that's all I want to hear. We don't need to be best friends to win. The world is filled with different personalities, beliefs, and that's okay by me. Are you the best player in this draft class? Oh yeah, without a doubt. No doubt at all? <sighs> Look, it might sound arrogant, but yeah, I play to be the best. That's what drives me, so I keep track of all these guys and what they're doing throughout the season, and honestly, there's nobody in this class that can do what I do. And that's just me keeping it real. One last question and then I'll let you go, Junior. I'm wondering, what's your primary motivation for joining the league? Hooping, it's all I care about. Can you expand on that a little? Sure, I mean, money's cool, money's nice. I won't turn it down. But uh, yeah, all of that, all that extra stuff is just icing on the cake. All right, that'll wrap it up. Wait, that's it? That's it. Thank you very much for your time, Junior. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> Thanks. It was nice to meet you. Nice talking with you. Best of luck in the draft. Thank you. That's not a good or a bad thing. Teams check out the data. Someone like you more, someone like you less. The summit won't matter. The deal is fluid. Mm. I'll, I'll take two of those. Yeah, but the results can change where I currently sit in the draft. I'm not hungry. You don't have to. You could stay exactly where you are right now. So I just gotta sit here and wait? I'm not here. There are a few days left before the next steps are taken. I figure you might enjoy your bet a little bit more. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you think this is so funny, man. This is a marathon, son. Breathe. Or should burn yourself out before we even get started. Okay? Hey, you D. What's good, my boy? Mr. 305. Yes, sir. Wade County. 16 years later. Next is media day. All the lottery picks get national attention, so everybody's got to cover it. I was rewatching Science Presser before he was drafted. Seemed pretty easy breezy. No tough questions. Nah, they're not going to dig too deep on lottery guys at this point. There's no upside in it. It should run smooth, but be on the lookout for those sideways questions. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, I'm good. This is going to be fun. Follow me, please. All right. Junior. 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 Right here. Junior. Right here. Right here. Right here. Junior. 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 And everybody's really happy to be starting a career, so that type of energy has just become really infectious. Obviously, you're a big-time talent, and anyone would be lucky to draft you, but where do you want to end up? Any preference? Well, I'm going into this thing with an open mind. I've got some thoughts going in, but perception, what the media tells you, um, that ain't always the truth. So I'm looking to meet with some people, have an open dialogue, and we'll see what they're all about. No preference at all, then. <laughs> I'm just looking forward to meet with teams and learning about what they're all about. OK. Is there any doubt in your mind that you're the best player in this draft? I mean, I'm right there if I'm not the top guy. So there's a lot of really good players in this draft, so it's hard to say who is the top guy, but I know I'm in the conversation. 
Okay, who's next? You're welcome. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, next we're going to a private workout. I'm gonna have a list of all the teams that are interested there. You just say which ones and I'll make it happen. Friend of mine, Damian Lillard's gonna Wait, be. Wait, hold on. You're friends with Dame Lillard? That's so hard to believe. <laughs> well, met maybe, but friends seem like a stretch. All right, somewhere in the middle, okay? All this right. manager owes me a favor. Anyway, Damian's gonna be at the workout to give you some guidance. <sighs> That's amazing, man. I'm a huge fan of his. Thank you. Just do what you gotta do, and remember to use Damian as a resource because that's what he's there for. And save the selfies for next year when you're in the league. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> yeah. Yo, what up, Dane? Junior, what's going on, man? And not much, man. I appreciate you doing it. It's all good, man. I yeah. wish I had somebody to mentor me and walk me through it, so it's all good. All right, so what you gonna tell me about this, man? What's, the, what's up with this process? The first thing I'm gonna tell you is you gotta go into this with confidence because you're being evaluated for every little thing, your demeanor, the skills, um, your athleticism, every single thing, they take a note of it. So you got to go in here with a mentality that you belong, and the hype is real. I appreciate you saying confidence because I'm nervous, man. We was all nervous. Everybody that went through this process and became legends and became all-stars and all that, they went through the same thing, had the same nerves, and they got through it just like you're going to get through it. How did you deal with everybody taking notes and watching and looking for your flaws and, you know, trying to pick your game apart and everything? I went into the gym and I pretended like nobody was there. I pretended like I was back home in Oakland, getting one of my workouts in, and it all worked out. So you got to do the same. All right. All right, I'm going to try to shake it off, man. Any last words of advice before I go in here? Go get them. All right, man. I appreciate it. Good luck to you. Thanks, man. Hey, good to see you. Stay focused on your workout.
Just like that. What's going on, man? Off day today. What can I do now, man? Yeah, that was bad in there, man. Hopefully they don't they don't evaluate you off one bad performance and you still get picked. But you gotta learn from this that you gotta prepare yourself a lot better than that, because that should never happen with the kind of opportunity that's in front of you. So going forward, you gotta get it in, man. You gotta work way harder, prepare yourself way better. So the next opportunity, you don't let it slip like this possibly could have. So you know, yeah. keep your head up. You know, stay right. You're going to be good. I hope so, man. When you talk about Junior, all you can say is short fire lottery pick. Right there in black and white, baby. <laughs> I can't do it. I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. Just enjoy it and get some rest. Oh. <laughs> And don't touch anything sharp. Don't ride anything fast. And whatever you do, don't jump off of anything high. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, I couldn't have done it without your partner. You're almost there, bro. Come on. Hey, you D. What's good, my boy? Mr. 305. Yes, sir. Wait. Yo, man, I'm wired, bro. Yo, me too, me too. I mean, I know it's good to like to go to bed early and all that, but I'm bouncing off the walls right now. Yo, I'm bugging too. 
It's like, this is all too crazy, man. Like, this is my life, you know what I mean? I do. I mean, the NBA is right there. It's amazing, but it's tomorrow. Yeah. Yo. What? Let's go out. Aw, oh, man. We can't go out party. We get caught and it goes viral, man. We are gonna be done. <laughs> I'm not talking about partying, man. Where are you trying to go then? Idea. Nah, it's fine. Take pics with fans, watch some street ball. It's innocent, and it's something old school about it. The media will eat this up. No risk. Junior and Henry. Bro, what's up, <laughs> bro? Oh, snap. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? What's up, man? Let me guess, y'all here for draft night, huh? Yeah, yeah, man. That's yeah, a big yeah, night. Right. You feel yeah. excited? Yeah. Okay. You know what? What do you? Th I got an idea. How about we get warmed up? Let's uh. Let's go twos. What you think, man? Oh, let's go some twos. Two? Yeah. Let's have some fun. I mean, unless, unless y'all scared of my boy. Ah, uh, man, I'd be scared. Come on. <laughs> you got jokes. You got jokes. Oh, well, I'm man. down. I ain't never scared. Hey, uh, what, you think? what you think, Junior? Come on, man. Friendly competition. Hold on one second. Let me holler at you. Oh, one second. What's up, man? All right, let's think this through, man. All these fans, all these cameras. This is go really bad for me, man. Okay, okay. Pros and cons, right? Right. Right? Yeah. Cons. He beats us, that goes viral, we look like trash, and our draft stock washes right up the Hudson River. Yeah, that's bad, man. All of that sounds really bad. Pros. We take them down, that goes viral, we become legends, our draft stock goes through the roof. But you already the top prospect, man. I'm just saying, we, because we're teammates here. And it feels right. But, but, you are correct. I have no downside here. So listen, Junior. Things can go bad real quick. I mean, that is Zion. Yeah. So that's why I'll let you make the choice. If you win, I'm in. If you're not, you sit back and watch the Zion show. All right. All right, all right. So we talked about it. So you guys ready to take me on? Or not? You think I'm gonna miss a chance to get at you in front of all these people? I see you, Junior. You want some of this smoke? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, do we? Do we? Do Let's we. go. All right. I don't lose, man, at all. <laughs> hey. We ready, then. We're about to take out these top prospects, man. Uh, over with. Let's go. We get ball.
Check it out. We're already trending on social. <laughs> I looked up in that video too, man. Got your boys good side. <laughs> this is definitely gonna help our draft stop. Oh uh, yeah, that's what's up. Man. Guys, hey fellas, good game, all right? I appreciate that, good man. Good game, game, man. man. Might work. I don't yeah. know how y'all won, but y'all some real hoopers, <laughs> yeah. man. I mean, that. we definitely gonna beat you next time, for sure. Yeah. I wish y'all the best of luck tomorrow. It's the biggest night of y'all life. That's right. Have fun and enjoy the moment. Yeah. I'll see y'all in the league. Yeah, yeah, you sure. will. We'll see y'all soon. Yes, sir. Right. Don't be salty. <laughs> hey, UD. What's good, my boy? Mr. 305. Yes, sir. Wade County. Excuse me. Hey, what's up, Arch? That's how you feel. Ah, uh, yeah, man, I'm good, I'm good. Look a little tense. Yep. Definitely tense. <laughs> Take a look around. So is everyone else. In good company. Mm. Supposed to help me, man? Mm. Helpful stuff would be to say, uh, imagine everyone in their underwear or in a clown's nose, like in one of those public speaking classes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so is that helpful? Uh, I never found it to be. This is crazy, man. Dad's supposed to be here, not me. You might as well know this now. Your dad was a good player and a great teammate. Influenced a lot of people. But he wasn't half the player you are. And if he were here, he'd feel the same way. I think he would have said he was proud of me. I mean, I mean we both know those words would never left his lips, right? <laughs> like, never. Uh, never. <laughs> but he would have been thinking it. Tonight marks the realization of a dream for the best young players in the world. A reward for their many... <laughs> With the first pick in the NBA draft, the Los Angeles Lakers select Hendricks Cobb from West Virginia. <laughs> yes! <laughs> With the second pick in the NBA draft, the Los Angeles Lakers select Junior from UCLA. <laughs> yeah, Arch. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Earth is boy. Yeah, baby. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you, guys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> My man. 
Congratulations. Yeah! people live on this planet? 7.8 billion. You know how many in the NBA? Not that many. <laughs> Look, I just gotta thank you, coach. I wouldn't even be here if you hadn't talked me into it way back when. Ordinarily, I'd say you did all the work. But in this case, yeah, I'll take the credit. <laughs> I guess I walked into that one. Hey, let's cheer some coffee or whatever it's around here. Let's do it. Yes. To Junior, Newark's finest. You made it. I'm really, really proud of you. Bravo. This life is a long story, son. Just make sure you remember who you are, yeah? This place. Sure, Dad. I will. 